popped out again. And still not going that close to the amber eyed lioness. Surveying his his domain. Now, Tatty's wondering: Does a lioness seeing another member of the pride's cubs have a biological or hormonal effect on them? Well, Tatty, probably not. Um, most of the... Oh, there we go. Wait, just hang on, Tatty. We'll get back to your question now. Mom's moving out towards where the amber-eyed lioness is. Now, remember that initial aggression we saw has now seems to have gone. And this is Mom now encouraging the cubs to come even closer. The other two are wrestling away in the thicket, but they should come out shortly. Tired kitty. Isn't that just absolutely gorgeous? Back to back in Kuma lionesses. And all the amber eyes is watching the elephants move through the bush. wondering how old will these cubs be before they start eating meat um, if meat is available to them they will eat it at as young as six weeks these guys are probably eight nine weeks old now so they would definitely eat meat if they were taken to a carcass are playing in the thicket, so we'll wait for them to come out again. And we're just seeing what's happening. Well, Nancy would like to keep them at this size forever. They're so adorable. Now that they are, Nancy, but for the future of the pride, the more of the female cubs that make it to adulthood, the better. Well, there we go. About to pop out into the open again. All but tackled beforehand. Three out now. My 
might use mom as a springboard to climb onto auntie. Cub touching faces with amber eyes. All three out again. So from this age onwards, they're going to get a lot more boisterous, a lot more playful, especially after they're introduced to their other five little cubs of the Nkuma pride. I think we're going to be spoilt for the next little while when it comes to cub viewing. Not to say we haven't been spoilt already. Sometimes it's just wonderful to sit quietly and watch the shenanigans. Oh. Oh, I thought for a second one of them had got hold of Amber's tail, but it's Mom's tail. Probably not quite brave enough just yet for the auntie's tail, but Mom's tail is a favorite toy. seems to be ignoring quite well. Oh, it's seen Amber's tail, it's moving. Is this, could this be the cub's first faux pas? They've just spotted the elephants. <laughs> uh, the little cubs, oh, they've just spotted the elephants on the other side of the dam. I don't think the elephants are going to hold their tension for too long, not with tails around. for a better lion sighting than this. Tasha, there we go. Tasha's wondering whether the amber-eyed lioness would be rough with them because it's the first time meeting them. Uh, Tasha, you never know. Uh, sometimes lionesses can be quite aggressive the first time meeting cubs, specifically if the cubs 
you know, bite their tails or do anything like that, but so far Amber seems to have been the doting aunt. that perfect light and perfect little cubs. Oh, don't look at Amber's tail. That might get you into trouble. Uh oh Oh, tail. Oh, not quite brave enough with Amber yet to attack her tail. Well, attack a sibling instead. <laughs> 